start? Whenever you're ready. All right. Hey guys, welcome to McGuire's. Uh, we are here at NACE uh, and we're at McGuire's. We're launching a new headlight and spot repair system for 2010. And as you know, there's millions of cars on the road with defective headlights. Um, these lenses are all manufactured of polycarbonate and the, the coatings are going bad. Many of you will replace a hit on the, the passenger side and you'll find that the driver's side is, is far from uh, a desirable appearance. And one of the things you can do is number one, increase your CSI essentially by going above and beyond the customer's expectations and just taking 15 minutes to knock out a lens. Um, it really helps minimize their eagle eye on the repair. And uh, the other option is to, to literally have a, a profit center within your body shop, an additional expansion of your capabilities, which would be to offer paint or uh, headlight repair. So this system that we've launched is a real comprehensive uh, system. Yeah, please stop. Get ready. That's fine. We're going to keep going. We'll edit. Cool. Yeah. It's a comprehensive system, uh, ranging in abrasives from 320 grit all the way up to 3000. And if you can see, this lens is uh, got some severe delamination of the coating that's applied by the factory. And we're going to uh, basically process this. I'm going to pre-clean both lenses, typically with a glass cleaner. And we're going to dry sand with the least aggressive method, typically starting with 500. Uh, and if you find that that's not ag of aggressive enough, you can graduate to 320. So we're sanding off the, the coating. You'll find that uh, an average lens repair takes 15 minutes, and if you choose to utilize this as a profit center, you, the average lens will bring around $75, uh, $75 repair. So we're, we're essentially removing that coating. The majority of your effort will be put into the initial sanding process, which is removing the coating. Now we're simply refining. Starting off secondly with 500. Graduating to 800 with an interface. It's important that you use the interface pad. And we're going to move to a 1000 grit Meguiar's finishing disc. This is going to be utilized in a wet fashion. Slightly dampen the disc with just pure water. And you'll start to see the clarity wow. coming back. And that you did in three minutes. Is that three minutes? Yeah. Train so. professional. <laughs> All right. Then we're going with the Meguiar's 3000 grit finishing disc, and this is also done wet. And understand the discs, the sanding disc, you'll, you'll consume anywhere from two to three discs per step on a full lens. And on the finishing disc, the foam finishing disc, they may last five to six lenses. So you want to really treat them like a tool. <laughs> now we'll graduate to a mini polisher our sanding backing pad uh, with our easy buff knitted wool pad this is gonna remove those scratches quickly this is the same uh, buffing pad we'll use on fresh paint for isolated spot repair we're gonna go with McGuire's ultra cut compound try not to splash splatter <laughs> Time you're walking through the parking lot or out in your uh, at your shop, take a look at your your customers' lenses and, and see dollar signs. 
<laughs> there's, uh, there's millions of headlamps on the road right now that are, are literally causing hazards to your customers, reducing visibility both for the, the driver as well as the oncoming driver. So, wow. for a quickie, before, after, you're going to find that most lenses you're going to see three to four hundred percent increase in lumens output, your light output. Followed up one more time with our soft buff polishing pad. Once again, I'll try not to splatter you. This only takes a dime size, and this just this just restores the clarity. That's awesome. So. And that guys, is all part of a new kit in January, right? Yep, we've got a new kit coming out in January. It's going to be for both headlight and spot repair. Uh, instead of sanding an entire hood, you guys are laying down the paints clear or low texture. Just go in and grab the isolated nibs with our 1500 grit, followed with 3000 in the same polishing process I just did on the lens. So, That's awesome. Thanks, guys. Thank you.